turn the music a little bit down. So this is Leftovers versus the Metal Slaves. Uh, this is the qualifier, I think the best qualifier match there is for the 3v3 tourney. Coming up if this ever hits the YouTube. And um, yeah, I'm not sure what else settings I have to adjust. So uh, introducing the players, it's the Flash, the CJ and the Shad versus the uh, Mitvit. Uh, X Factor and Yoto, who is apparently missing and rejoining. Great, great. I'd say the Flash and the Shad and the CJ should be favorites. They just uh, beat uh, my team Barco on one of the maps after a uh, couple of straight losses, but uh, they definitely got their cohesion together. I'll adjust the music. And desktop audio right here. Alrighty. Last stream test, stream starting in like 50 seconds for me, so, um, and the game starting at 50 seconds. And we're off. All right, let me zoom in, see what's what. The shotgun is going to go for the core vehicles. Brave choice with an LLT in a bag. DJ is going to look up to set up probably vehicles right there in the spot. The flash also going to set up the vehicles. Using the arm. Who would have ever suspect that the Flash is going to go with the uh, vehicles? X Factor setting up the LLT and going for the. The zoom also. It's pretty classic. Mitfit as the carry in the middle. You love the auto opening. Uh, triple mix into double solar into vehicles. That's a strong build. That's the uh, only greedy build. Uh, that's off to Yodo. Doesn't make like LLTs like the other dudes do. Who needs LLTs either way, right? So, even X Factor made here in this position. And Midwit main. The Yoto is just like, I'm the baller, man. Let me get my 3 mix and double solar. Let's see if it's gonna bite any him in the ass. Midwit's expansion is kind of interesting going for almost a 5x before anything in 3v3. That's pretty good. I think uh, MBT tried today on uh, Theta Crystals here. Yoto is spamming uh, some scouts. Maybe end dump. I'll put the map bigger for you guys if on the stream. Not sure of the quality. I hope it's alright. First blood on the corner. Flash loses one scout. Factor drives uh, unimpeded. We'll have a scout in the position. Let me check the cues. So CJ going for more blitzes, mixes, blitzes. Flash going for a couple of cons, more pawns, more ticks, and a res bot. Yeah, mostly focusing, gonna go where you're focusing on the lashers, missile tricks, quite the hype lately. Multiple cons from X Factor, uh, no, I mean scouts, right? Um, we'll likely, could try to pressure this position as well, 
not that much uh, rovers or to take the horn down, but will definitely be annoyance in the back. Loses one without no pressure. How is this on the maneuver? That's interesting. The flash. I don't know if that's the default. Maybe, maybe it's the default. It's not the realm. I'm overhyping myself. Blitz is in the making here. Expected playing so far pretty timidly. Trying to cover most of his base with the blitzes. Met with after five mechs is just starting to get some incisors out right now. And Yota is pushing to clear the bottom. Uh, completely unaware of this, right? So I just played versus I just played a game versus this team, and uh, this spot wasn't covered, and they completely uh, ambushed me from this here spot. Yota also not having the same defense, and uh, Midrit has to respond. Losing. Two mechs, although not perfect by leaving such metal, two, getting two mechs is, is a big deal since rebuilding will take time and you will lose out on income as you can see here. This income is not that big by, let's say, like 8 to 10% depending on when it was killed, when it was more even. Expect you're going to respond with the blitzes on a north as well. Flash has barely some pawns. I, I'm not sure it's gonna be enough. Likely not. LLT is not in the making. Should lose all of these three mixes, maybe. All well, the pawns doing really good, but yeah, still should lose all the three mixes here. Well played by X Factor, recognizing to 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 kill the mixes. That's big. The tick went here, but ignore the mix. Additionally, we'll get this mix as well. With having a large incisor group in the middle. Not sure what he didn't kill, but uh, Yoto also going for the raid. Going for the mix. Oh. Yeah, I guess Shed is covered. There's not much opportunities for, l for, 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 for. To do any raids in the bag. Having the LLTs here, but. You know, Yoto has some scouts at least. Chad's kind of alone there with a couple of flashers and incisors. It's like, it's not going to stop the calm. I would wish for Mitwit to be a little bit more aggressive. Yoto pinging that the blitzes could be an issue. And indeed they are. So he's just really focused on killing this position. Which is uh, really funny that <laughs> I was in that position. But the, the sides skirmish for a little bit of army. We don't see no massive uh, self D's or whatever. So yeah, Mithwit's ch gonna chase the Captain Jack's uh, raid. Captain Jack manages to CJ, who's splitting one. Will mightily get this mix. And gonna raid to back out. Well played by CJ. Love those stuff. In the north, the X Factor is doing the classic. I think it's uh, the ratio of two, two Stumpies, one Janus. Decides to get more Kanza. Right above, uh, as I'm about to say. Flash holding strong, or maybe not that strong with 93 per, uh, HP on his commander. Yota also chilling, not doing too much. Good repair here or there. On the income it looks like it's about even, although I would put uh, the uh, Flash's team the favorites due to the raid that happened here. I found it really curious that uh, the team doesn't, that, like they do not have a single bot player, which means there's no res bot accessibility, which means there's no, any quick and easy way to get the bots. I would believe at least one position could do like uh, grunts. X Factor coming in with the Deacons. Deacons a little bit of stuff away. Pawns diving uh, stuff. 
Flash really sticking into his comfort meta. Uh, comfort meta. Mostly doing only uh, lots right now. Has tech to the vehicles, but you know, Mitwit is up there with the incisors. And CJ expelling all of his forces onto Yoto doesn't really have the answer. This is big. I mean, if he takes out all of the energy and doesn't feed that much, it will be really, really nice for the um, Meta Slaves. Yeah, Meta Slaves. For example, like running here. Oh, transferring the troops to the DJ, CJ responds. This is pretty interesting. I also want to look at the stuff because Flash right here. Flash has like no HP and there's Janus here. This raid is going to get cleaned up, but CJ indeed loses all of the energy. And this battle is still, I would say, pretty even. Like Shad tried to do this siege potential with the Lashers, but Yoto, even though raided, he was still damaged. Uh, he was still able to scrap some metal. Uh, I think if the Meta Slaves invest in more like build power, they have a, like a really good chance. So far for me, it's looking like a pretty good advantage for the Meta Slaves as the leftovers can't really grasp and CJ has lost all the energy. Uh, one thing that could get back is uh, if the Flash could make like resbounds for CJ to resurrect whatever is like the free, uh, free solar collectors. That would be big. But you know the middle position is like lost on the two places, and I would I would still consider this even, especially with the Shad Hunters commander moving back. Yoto will go go for the Deegans and scare the stuff away. I'm surprised really to see so limited resbound play on this match. So many nanos for X Factor. Probably worthwhile. I would really wish it would slap down the bot lab and the more A sellers, but you know, they they play you. X Factor controlling the map against the flash up to this position. TJ get back and getting back on the energy, but uh, not producing anymore. Going for the communism strategy as well, and yo, Shad also going for the communism, so they have realized that, yeah. Sharing is caring, right? Other team don't use no, doesn't use no communism strategies right now. Yeah, it looks like the Frontline has been stabilized, Mitwit holding in the middle with Stumpy. CJ has regained most of the problematic army, taking more Stumpies, but um, yeah, not really scaling build power that much. So they, I would say, about even with Mitwit holding the most of the territory, which means income advantage. I think Yot Yoto is like, s s I would say slowly, I would I wanted to say slowly losing, but he did control this territory, which means he has likely uh, more income. 29 versus Shad's 20. Yeah, that's big. That's like 40 to 50% increase. Mid return trouble. CJ looking. Well, thought maybe CJ looking for the combo, but not the case. CJ saw the Midwitz commander and decided to retreat after Shad's attempted breakthrough to the north. Yeah, but I'm not sure about that uh, breakthrough right here. Um, Yoto might be able to gain the initiative by repushing. For example, this reclaim is pretty big. It's like, even this little part is like 1.4k. Let's look at the north. Flash fighting fiercely back against X Factor, but guys, I think the... I think the Metal Slaves have this. I think, I think we're gonna go to the forest. And on the forest, I would give the advantage to Flash and Hunter the CJ. Well played, well played. I wasn't a believer in triple vehicle and no communism, but they're doing it. If we look at the damage, the 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 the, the leftovers just can't can't like nobody of them have traded well, like not a single lane. Hmm. 
Granted, to be said, like, Mithrid has lost his calm in the middle. But, you know, this this breakthrough... Well, breakthrough, breakthrough. <laughs> it says Twilight. But still, even this one Stumpy will be, like, if if if, if it was rallied right here, it, it can do, like, a lot of damage. Usually, like, two Stumpies on the north, and, you know, you lose the back nexus, and... And there goes the CJ's commander. I don't think it killed anything worth of value. I think Mitwit got it almost for free. And Chad's super low. It's 2v2. 2v2 with the commanders. And I think middle is complaining too much for it to be resolved. The Shad doesn't have the answer to uh, respond to the middle as well to the Yato and the Yotos. And uh, as a 1v1 player, e extremely aggressive and we just continue to press advantage until he runs out of the steam. So he will be able to dictate the rules versus the Shad Hunter. Um, I would like to say that all three lanes lost here, which is uh, good news. This is really good stuff for uh, the Meta Slaves. And they're not stopping, they're not stopping, really. I would assume that the uh, Mitwit could uh, use and pump more army. Given he's overfloating on metal, but that's likely because he reclaimed the commander one and... Should keep pushing for the commander number two, yeah. And Shad's dead, baby. Shad's completely dead. Trying to cloak, but... <laughs> Even the rotating missiles is, uh, is, 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 let, let me see, Yoto Pro Camp. I figured maybe he has like a set target, and that's GG. Alrighty. I'm not sure if I have anything to show you. Tried to show Sky Lobby. Or is next? <laughs> I see this cat uh, catching up to my own stream now. Three minute delay, guys. I'm not gonna be able to answer, but uh, thank you, Skag, for being here. Uh, you know, first time chat and all, and Sabu as well. They're gonna probably keep deciding on the strategies right here. I and I think middle my is title as well, I guess. For it to be resolved, the Shad doesn't have the answer to uh, respond to the middle as well to the Yato and the Yotos. And uh, as a 1v1 player, e extremely aggressive and we just continue to press advantage until he runs out of the steam. So he will be able to dictate the rules versus the Shad Hunter. Um, I would like to say that all three lanes lost here, which is uh, good news. This is really good stuff for uh, the Meta Slaves. And they're not stopping, they're not stopping, really. I would assume that the uh, Mitwit... Alright, here we go, Horus. I mean, if Metal Slave ships this, I'd be really surprised. Uh, it's... Uh, I guess everybody can uh, could think that the Leftovers is, like, favorites here. Uh, especially with the CJ. Uh, dear friend and my <laughs> past teammate. <laughs> And cure and clan member, uh, and the flash, of course, uh, flash with the team widget and all with all. But uh, yeah, surprising result on the comet. But 
Yeah, I mean, most of the Meta Slave team are aggressive team, and on the Camel Catcher, there's not that much options for mistakes. On the Horus, I think the experience should take over. They're going to put the flash in the middle, uh, apparently. Probably shouldn't spoil one day when it's like two, 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 two minutes in. But yeah, it is what it is. Let me check my stream, actually. Is there any uh, hackers? VO3. Uh, the answer. Alrighty. Everybody's saying good luck, have fun. No fun allowed, uh, of course. It's a qualifier. It's who nobody should have fun. Also, why would you like actually wish the luck for the <laughs> for your opponents? So yeah, I mean the the the, the Flash CJ team and Shab already going for the communism from the start. Not full communism, just a little bit of communism. I don't know how it works. Maybe that was their downfall. These guys are gonna keep uh, showing on trucking their 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 own individual stuff, so probably shouldn't introduce too much. Nobody has like anything interesting in a queue as well. They're not going for vehicles. I don't know, man. Vehicles here as well. Vehicles, bots. This is reasonable. Has the Whistlers corrupted the minds of the players? What the fuck? Alright, so Flash is gonna basically do some ticks into a lot of pawns. That makes complete sense to me. Um, Rowers, con Blitzes for Yodo on the bottom. Bit, bit, queuing up some ticks. And con ticks and pawns. X-Factor. Rover into Constructor. Did we check Shad? Shad's on the Gator, I mean Incisor, Double Con, Incisor and Lashes. No changes, like Shad's just gonna, I'm gonna make my side tracks. Alright. I think, I think still like, we even even if like with all the com up the changes, I th still think for the middle, like the, the Plasma bots are really good. You, you see these hills? This is hill. If I wouldn't be like, uh... That bad to switch to the camera. Yeah, let's see action. X-Factor coming in with a couple of rovers. DJ has like tick defense. Doesn't see nothing. One tick stops. <laughs> Lagging off. I don't think these will make that far. And aware them, but these will. That's gonna now chase. Lost the max actually. And it's gonna park like here and be annoying, like come get me in the corner or whatever. Flash responding with the tick in the back. Farming that XP, that's filthy. One tick also here. I mean rower. And that does get the max. This max was also lost. And Shadhunter is built mix, so I think the situation has been stabilizing, but uh, so far, like, dude, like, Meta Slabs have been, like, getting advantage. You can see right here, 29 versus 26, it isn't big, it's like 200 metal, but it's, you know, how they say, it's something, right? Yeah, thank you, thank you for OPP stream, Rumble Crush. Uh, hope you like it. I wanted to watch this game because uh, was uh, probably the closest, closest quality game I think for sure. And I'm surprised, like I'm kind of hyping, like I was. Uh, I love underdogs, man. Like uh, some kind of even though CJ's, <laughs> I want to. I, they would be the better team and all. I still want like the Meta Slaves to win because it it would be pretty big and they doing it. Look, look, CJ has no energy. No, no back metal. This is big. Where these pawns came from, Metvit? 
Flash sleeping hashtag, right? No, 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 no. Has pushed forward here, but uh, has no security, right? Probably was. I don't know what Flash was distracted to. I think the cohesiveness lacks because, like, missile tricks are too slow. I think you need bots here, right? You need to be to the middle. And. DJ blaming bag uh, bug. I doubt anyone gonna, like, recoast or anything for them. And CJ leaves the vehicle lab, unbuilt. Oh, Rick Spectre is coming for him. That's that sucks, dude. Yeah, I get still LT. Tell me no J. Oh, he has Janus in this composition. And Metwitch trying to break through through these hills. I love these hills, man. These hills are absolutely wonderful. And Shad, you know, he has like missile tricks. He will make progress in like uh, just give him like ten more minutes. Get there. And yeah, Mitwit completely changing the dynamic, rallying like uh, mass-producing pounds. This is how Mitwit actually won the, uh, the uh, myth and the legend, the cartouche. You know, stay at your base, pump pounds, and just you know, nobody's gonna expect and like. They have stuff, but you suddenly just come in with like a blob of these, and if you don't have LLTs at the right position, that's it's pretty good. And even if you have like LLTs like here, it's it doesn't really matter, right? One, maybe lose two. Yeah, no, just one. So you just lost one pawn to LLT. Pretty good deal, if you ask me. He's just reinforcing his. Uh, Whatever is left, and uh, yeah, Medved's coming in the middle. Guys, I think it's gonna be 2-0 two, two, two with one base down and 3k. Um, I could say that, you know, there's a chance and whatnot, but clearly the missile trucks... Uh, the missile trucks versus missile trucks will be stalled, and there's no way anything makes progress from this. And, uh, and if the mid is open, you can run like this, and you can run like this, and you can run like this. And there's no chances, and uh, from the commander perspective, Flash doesn't have his commander apparently. I might have missed it where it blew up like nicely, it looks like here. No, that was CJ's, oh, oh, I get it. This is Flash commanders, this is CJ. CJ lost his commander, and the Flash gave the commander to try to stall the games, but I think the Meadow Slaves will advance uh, to the qualies, and that means the leftovers are uh, not going to participate tomorrow, sadly. Um, in fact, like, I don't know if Fix Factor could trade before blowing up and not blowing up himself. Nyoto still being able to push the commander back, even though there's no metal, and... He uses the time to actually ship the metal, like a thousand. Might not be too good of a choice, given the fact that like his lane still needs to be won. Uh, if you're, uh, you know, could just double down on like one more uh, construction turret. But let's watch the game. I think the midwit with the pawn pushes will be really successful. It's on the horse, you know, pawns are really good. We did qualies here and I also won with the pawns. And Midwit has transitioned to the vehicles. No, just uh, you know, double double spawn could actually do uh, if you do the drag this thing out and put your calm on repeat. It would boost the boost both labs as a nano and a pro tip, and then it you know stays in the base and you don't die. And your Yoto, for example, could commit to uh, to the one of the last commanders, especially if he could get damage damage along with getting the calm. Alright, this mech's gonna die. Midfit? Focused on something else. Losing his army slowly. Trying to raid like a mix. But that's it for Shijo, it looks like. Hmm. Gem is not turning.
Yeah. Three versus two. If CJ trades versus X Factor, Chad Chad needs to retreat. So, and all of the metal is already in uh, Shad Hunter's pocket. I think CJ has like 200, but it doesn't matter. Should I do? This is smart. This is smart, actually. Maybe if you can so I don't think the self D range. Oh, that was nice. Self D. Got, gets to come. Gets to come. Oh, it's 1 1. Shad actually, Shad actually wins the Yoto's commander, which means it's 1 1. Of course, uh, Mitwit's calm is in a super safe position here at the base. And as you know, he has like a big counter-attack army and CJ really stopped well this uh, this position. What a game, guys. I wish actually that we that we went into the uh, third game because amazing quality match so far. And, you know, I would definitely put my stuff on uh, the favorites. But yeah. CJ calls resign. No more bases. And that's it, guys. Uh, Meta Slaves advance to the qualies. GG's. Alrighty.